Hello, and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once-a-day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is number 906, the category, Friday Night Pub Quiz, number 25. This is a 20-question trivia quiz with a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end of the video if you need to stick around for that. All of these questions come from various categories with varying degrees of difficulty, so good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. In what 1997 film does Chris Farley play a ninja? Some people even say he is the great white ninja who is investigating a counterfeiting crime ring in a wealthy California town. He plays the Great White Ninja in Beverly Hills Ninja. Question number two. Artie earned an unknown number of dollars at his job, but he had to pay 17% in taxes, which left him with $83. How much money did Artie make at his job before taxes? If you didn't overthink this, you'll know that the answer is $100. Question number three. What country's historical rulers have included the Nanda Dynasty, the Chalukya Dynasty, the Vijayanagara Empire, the Gupta Empire, and the Delhi Sultanate? That country is India. Question number four. His burial site is now known as KV-62, and a 2005 CAT scan concluded he died from gangrene after breaking his leg. The expedition that found what man was funded by Lord Carnarvon and was headed by Howard Carter. The answer is King Tut. Question number five. A criminal defendant might plead this in court if he doesn't wish to contest the accusation. By pleading what Latin phrase he accepts the penalties of conviction without having to admit guilt in a trial. That Latin phrase is nolo contendere. Question number six. Her full name includes middle initial A and last name Cavatica. She introduces herself with the word salutations and says her nearsightedness makes it hard to see her new friend. At the county fair, what E.B. White character finishes her magnum opus that is taken back to the farm by Wilbur? Her name was Charlotte. That story was Charlotte's Web. Question number seven. Those learning its skills may practice with kumite sparring using techniques learned from the kihon and the kata. Itosu Enko is sometimes called its grandfather. What martial art form's Japanese name means empty hand? The answer is karate. Question number eight. What author of the Spring and Autumn Annals and Books of History, Songs and Changes, known as the I Ching, founded a philosophy adopted by the Song Dynasty in China? The 
The answer is Confucius. Question number nine. In computer science, what term refers to the sequences of symbols that often hold word values? A term that can also refer to a section of an orchestra that includes violins. Sequences of symbols and the orchestra that includes violins that is known as strings. Question number 10. Carol Kapek is the person who first coined the term robot, doing so in his play RUR. Kapek was a popular writer from what country whose capital is Prague? The answer is the Czech Republic. Question number 11. Coldplay's Viva La Vida says that, I know this person won't call my name. A reference to his role in guarding the pearly gates at the entrance of heaven. Who is this Galilean fisherman said to be a rock of the Christian church? Standing at the pearly gates, the answer is St. Peter. Question number 12. Dimashita was an anime version of what cartoon whose villains include the Rowdy Rough Boys, the Gang Green Gang, Fuzzy Lumpkins, and Mojo Jojo, battled by Bubbles, Buttercup, and Blossom? That cartoon is the Powerpuff Girls. Question number 13. Located on the Jutland Peninsula north of Germany with the capital city of Copenhagen, what is the name of the country that sold the Virgin Islands of St. Thomas, St. John, and St. Croix to the United States in 1916? That country is Denmark. Question 14. This popular video game series set in Raccoon City prominently features scary video clips between scenes. Sequels and spin-offs of what game have included Survivor, The Umbrella Chronicles, Veronica, and Nemesis? That video game series is Resident Evil. Question 15. Usually its sessions allow each side 30 minutes. Its schedule is governed by the rule of four, where four of its members can agree to hear an appeal. When all members make a decision, it takes five for a majority. What is the name of the powerful judicial government body? The highest court in America, it is the U.S. Supreme Court. Question 16. This alumnus of LSU was drafted first overall by the Orlando Magic and played on the Phoenix Suns and the 2006 champion Miami Heat. But what athlete is best known for teaming up with Kobe Bryant to lead the Los Angeles Lakers to three consecutive NBA championships from 2000 to 2002? The answer is Shaquille O'Neal. Question 17. This game's name is the Swahili command for build. In Israel, it is called Mapolet or Avalanche. Denmark calls it Klodsmajer. 
meaning klutz. In Brazil, this game is called Torremoto, a play on the words for earthquake tower. What is this Hasbro game? The name we know it as is Jenga. Question 18. To a surveyor, one of these is equal to 80 chains, and it is also equal to 8 furlongs, one third of a league, and 1,780 times 36 inches. What is this unit of length equal to 5,280 feet? The answer is a mile. Question 19. I am pay design what often visited Cleveland, Ohio building that honors sidemen, early influences, and famous performers for their achievements in a genre of popular music. I am pay designed the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Question number 20. Their name means hole dwellers in the tongue of the Rohirrim, and they are called Perianath by the elves. In the year 1601 of the Third Age, two brothers of what race crossed the river Brandywine and founded the Shire? They were hobbits that founded the Shire. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Check back tomorrow. We'll have another new trivia quiz. I believe this weekend we're going to do two lightning rounds. I'll be in between Dayton, Ohio and... Lansing, Michigan? No, Grand Rapids, Michigan. We're going up there, so I've got to do a couple of quick episodes to make sure I can get them out on time. I'll be doing those hopefully from the hotel. Where I'm doing them right now, I'm sitting on the floor, and this is not an ideal situation for typing and recording a YouTube quiz show. Won't have to do this very long. Like I said, hopefully tomorrow and the next day I will be in the hotel sitting at a desk and then shortly after that I'll be back in England doing it the way I normally do it. I appreciate everybody who's watching who's being patient. I know this isn't the normal posting every day at the same time schedule that we're used to but I promise we will get back to that. Here is question 21 the tiebreaker for today's trivia. Lan Popo is a story from China based on this fairy tale. In Roald Dahl's Revolting Rhymes, she uses a gun and gains a new coat. Charles Perrault introduced the distinctive clothing worn by the heroine. What is this tale known in Italy as the False Grandmother? The False Grandmother, Revolting Rhymes, Lon Popo, all of those are versions of Little Red Riding Hood. That is it for today. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being patient. See you tomorrow for another new trivia quiz.